In this video, we're looking at construction 14, which is asking us to construct a right angle triangle where they give us the length of one of the sides and the size of one of the acute angles. Each exam question is going to differ. In this particular question, I'm going to work to an acute angle of 40 degrees and the length of the given side to be five centimeters in length. So before we start, just to give a quick sketch of what we're going to construct, we are basically looking at a right angle triangle where they give us the length of one of the sides, which is five, and a 90 degree and one of the angles to be 40 degrees. So that's what I need to construct now. First thing I'm going to do is construct this baseline of five centimeters. So I'm going to use my ruler now and my pencil to construct this line. So move your ruler to the center of the page, start the nib of your pencil at zero and draw your straight line out to five. When you remove your ruler, make sure and just mark uh, the end points on that line. So I'm going to place a dot at both ends and they'll represent A and B, two coordinates of my triangle. So I'm just gonna write in A and B beside them so I'm labeling them. So I have corner A and corner B. At this stage, you should also write in the length of that line segment and the length of that line segment is five centimeters. So just put a five beneath it to represent its length. Next step is to construct our angle of 90 degrees. So you can use your set square or your protractor for this step. I'm going to use my protractor here now for this. So I'm using um, a 90 degree angle with my protractor. So if I move my protractor over to the A, make sure that it crosses and then put a, a dot um, where it is 90 at the top. And then I'm going to remove my protractor and with my ruler, I'm going to draw a straight line starting at A through this green dot. It doesn't have to stop at the dot because we don't know the length of this side. So starting at A and going through my green dot doesn't have to stop at the dot. Okay, and mark in your 90 degree angle. That's the second thing we've now just constructed. So there's two parts, the length of five and the 90 degrees. Our final step is to construct the angle of 45 degrees. So once again, I'm going to use my protractor for this and I'm going to sit my protractor now at the angle B and create an angle of 40 degrees. So on your protractor, I'm going to mark 40 degrees. So I'm coming over here to the acute angle, which is corresponding to the 140. I'm putting a dot at um, the 40 there. Let's just change our color here. And what I'm going to do is with my ruler now, I'm going to connect the point B to this perpendicular line passing through this pink dot. So passing through the purple dot and starting at B, we draw our line and it intersects the perpendicular line. Notice that I'm not being extremely accurate. This is a construction, so I need to show all of my lines. So don't worry about these two ends here. Don't go rubbing them out. And that is our final step. So just to finish, we need to mark in our angle of 40 degrees and we have our angle here as 40 degrees. I'm just going to label where these two lines intersected. I'm going to label that my corner C on my triangle. So I'm putting a dot here and I'm going to label that point C. Thank you for watching another tutorial video from Tullamats. Make sure and subscribe.